back to another video. So in today's video I'm going to be filming a study with me but uh, this time as I've never done it before today's going to be like a vlog style study with me because as I gave you guys a study with me last week I thought we could do the same because I still have lots and lots of work to do but I thought that I could just change it up a bit so we don't have the same sort of theme all the time. So today's study, study with me is going to be vlog style so I can tell you guys all about my work and what I'm doing. Um, for my work, I mainly have a lot of history to do at the minute, like I did in my last study with me, that's just because I have a massive exam next week, because we have finished the medicine topic, so I can talk to you guys a little bit about that, and if you would like a separate video on that, please let me know, because I've literally done the whole medicine topic, so I could uh, do a video, video on like, just like, rounding it all up, like, because when you get tested, there's only like seven topics you get tested on. Um, but yes, I'm home now. It is only now five past three and we finished 15 minutes ago. Um, because I, I literally got out of school like three minutes early. So I thought I'd come into the kitchen and maybe get a drink of hot chocolate or just a milkshake or something. And just something quickly to eat and then I'm going to go upstairs. And I think I might start with history because that's just what I've got most to do. Um, I was going to do a bit of history. I've got a bit of my drama portfolio monologue. Um, music. I really need to get some of my composition done. And I really need to think what I'm going to do for my performance. Because I'm actually struggling. I'm choosing what I would like to do for my performance. Which is actually quite uh, quite bad so I'm going to speak to my teacher tomorrow and ask for some ideas because I'm really like struggling with like what I what I want to do for my performance this year because um I was going to do singing but I only started my singing lessons this year I'm not saying I'm not confident to do it it's just I only started my singing lessons this year so I'm not like that good like I'm gonna say I'm not like, I'm totally not good so um yeah so I'm gonna do some music and then photography, I have just some bits to, you know, finish up. And then maths, we got our test results back today. And obviously we're in our first out of three years of GCSEs. And I managed to get 47 out of 80, which is all right, because obviously I'm in my first out of three years. Um, so we did that today. And I also have some percentages work from a different maths teacher. English, I literally have no work I need to do for that one. And science, I don't really have any, like, work that I need to do. I don't think I'll do any science work today, but I really do need to like do lots and lots of science. Like I might want to order like some textbooks in science because science is one of those subjects in which I really struggle at. Like I'm a great, I, I don't mind saying this, I'm a grade one in science and I've literally just, I can't get science into my head. It just really confuses me so much and I don't know why it just really does. But um, but yes, because I'm also doing a study with me, um, as you may know, because you've clicked on this video, I will montage and do time lapses for the work I actually do because it's a bit hard to just like film it like normal speed and talk to you guys. I might also go live on Instagram, I'm not quite sure yet. But um but yeah, so that's the plan for today. Um but yeah, if you want I can montage until I do my first piece of work, so yeah. <laughs> upstairs in my room and before I start working and when I get home from school I do like to go on YouTube maybe watch a video or two because obviously I've just got home from school so I have literally just been learning some like new things uh, at school uh, so I thought I'd come home and actually you know like chill for like I do this for like 20 minutes to half an hour and then I'll write my to-do list but yeah, so now I'm just going to be watching a little bit of YouTube. Um, the time is now, I took my watch off, but the time is now uh, 17 minutes past. So I'll probably start working at around half past 22. Uh, but yeah, so I'll update you when I um, do my to-do list. <laughs>
my first piece of work in which I'm doing today is actually some of my music composing. Um, so there's not really a lot to film, so I probably won't really do a time lapse for this because literally all I'm doing is adding in like pieces of music. Literally, this is all I've done so far. It's not really a lot, but I, I can play it to you. But um, there's one of the there's a beat in the background in which you can hear it all the way through. That's not actually my thing. That's just because it's there. But you can guys can listen to it. It's only like a few seconds. So this is what I've done so far. So that is what I've done so far. Obviously, I can improve it quite a lot, you know, towards the end, because this doesn't have to be in for like a month or two. It could be completely different. So if you'd like me to like show you guys what it is in the end or like how to create and use GarageBand, let me know because GarageBand is basically you can get it on any MacBook. Um and uh yeah you can basically get it on any macbook and so i decided or imac but um I, that's why i decided to get a macbook as well because i wanted to do some of my music work so yeah so now i'm going to do this for around about half an hour and see how much i can get done and then i'll update you guys again because i won't do a time lapse for this so guys the time is now 20 past four so i have been working on this for about half an hour now and as you can probably see it doesn't really look a lot different here because there's still like the same amount but it's basically completely different because i've decided to go with the song the crocodile this is something that i'm singing in my singing lessons and so i have started to uh write the notes uh of what they are if, apart from from these like bits here I don't really know how to do those so I'm gonna ask my music teacher and how I uh, do those into GarageBand uh, but yeah so I've done up to um, here if I point it out I've done up to air here so I've done all of this so I'm actually gonna play this to you guys now because it's completely different to what I was doing and I thought it would be so much better because I could actually sing with this bit as well so I'm now going to play that for you guys so here we go So there you guys have it, that is what I've done so far. I know that's not really a lot for half an hour, but um, it actually is because if you saw the notes down here, as soon as I played them onto, because I had to do it by this, and I could use my keyboard to say if it went. So I had to like edit all of them to make sure they were the right pitch and everything like that. So that actually took me half an hour. Um, so now I'm going to go for a quick uh, toilet break and um, then I'm going to go straight on to, uh, let's have a look at my list actually. I next need to do some, so we can tick this off. What did we just do? We just did carry on composing we just did some of that so now i might actually do some of my mind maps because i might as well get those out of the way because they were actually something we had to do in the lesson in which i couldn't finish so i'm going to do my mind maps uh, next and obviously i can do a time lapse for that <laughs> in my class I got given this uh, sheet year 9 end of medicine course to-do list so in my lesson I obviously did these one uh, no these ones very well and very quickly um, because I didn't really have any work to catch up on so I went straight to doing these and I only got a few of these done in class because obviously I was helping other people finish and everything so these are the seven case studies in which are going to come up in our test or a big exam we're going to do so that's the Black Death, William Harvey, uh, the Great Plague, Edward Jenner, John Snow, Penicillin and the fight against lung cancer and so I started to create some mind maps in class and had to finish them off at home so this is the Black Death then I have William Harvey, The Great Plague, Edward Jenner, Jon Snow, Penicillin, 
fighting against lung cancer in the 21st century. So these are all of them literally done. So this is actually my second book, as you can see. And then if I just get this here, this was my first book because there's actually like quite a lot of work and we do a lot of like sheets and there's quite a lot of work for this course. So now it is about time I head round the corner to my uh, Nan's place because she's good doing a roast dinner for dinner tonight. So um, obviously I won't be able to film anything there, but with me I am going to take some flashcards. Probably not all of these because there's quite a lot here, and I'm also going to take this book with me. So everything I've I've done on my mind maps, I'm going to create flashcards and then um, bring them home to stick in my folder so basically this is my uh folder so basically all i've got in here is medieval britain renaissance britain 19th uh, no 17th uh blah, 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 18th and 19th century and modern britain and then on each of the card things you can see i've written what topics i've got in there some of them i do uh do already have and i've already covered as you can see there's a lot of, for that one but i want to cover a lot more um, just so I, you know, I've got the course 100% correct. And then maybe after that I might do some more history, depending on how much I get done. If not, I might do some drama, or, uh, more music, or maths, or something like that, okay? So I will see you guys, uh, in a little while. So guys, I'm now back from dinner, and while it was dinner I was able to make some flashcards. Actually, I managed to make quite a few flashcards. Um, only about, like, 10, 11 or something like that. And I made them on William Harvey and the Black Death. Um, so I haven't really um, done it on the plague, uh, Jon Snow or anything yet. Uh, well, I have, obviously. But um, So I'm going to do those now uh, because I just haven't finished all of them. And um, because you must have seen, like, flashcards being made before... Um, on one of these study videos that you must have watched from other people. I mean, if you're someone here who's watching a study video, that's either because you make study videos yourself or you you like watching study videos. So you must have seen, like, flashcards before. Um, if not, they, they look like this, except they have highlight on them, which I haven't quite done that yet. I might use a bit of yellow and some down there. Um, but then I also haven't written the answers on the back yet. Um... Just because I like to write my answers in a blue pen. And I also like to highlight the title. So I need to highlight William Harvey and the Black Death on every single card. Um, but yeah, I like to write the answer in a blue pen. And I forgot this pen. So I'm going to do that as well. But um, yeah, so I'm not going to film it. And I'm going to go live on Instagram instead. So if you guys watched that, uh, thank you for joining. And yeah, so I will... Um, I'm a, I'll do like I'll show you all my flashcards when I finish making them. So I've just finished my live video on Instagram. It went actually really really well. Um, I managed to do a set of my um, what are they called flashcards. I did the Great Plague. These ones here. I managed to highlight them and also underline the titles. And these are my old ones, which already have the answers on the back, but I also had to highlight these ones as well because they hadn't been highlighted yet. So I decided in the end that I was going to go for orange for Renaissance, green for um, Medi... No. Why have I highlighted Medieval here in green? Oh. They're meant to say modern. It's because they both begin with M. Right, I need to highlight that one green, green. They're okay. But yeah, <laughs> I really hate it when I'm making mistakes. It makes me go like this. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so I might give you guys a time lapse now so I can finish them because I've got um, four more lots of my maps to make of flashcards. Like, today is going so quickly. I don't even know what the time is. The time is now 25 past 7 and I've literally done hardly anything. So I'm going to do these and then I'm going to go on my checklist and see what else I've got to do. I know I've got quite a lot to do, but... Um, yeah, hopefully we can finish it all today. If not, you know, I've still got Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, but yeah, so time for the time lapse. <laughs>
time is now 10 to 8. Actually, the time today has gone so much quicker. So I think it's time that I now update my uh, to-do list. So Jon Snow mind map I have done. So I can tick that off. Um, how would it be? There you go. Uh, Penicillin mind map I have done. I'm just going through my book as I'm doing this. And lung cancer mind map I have done. Um, flashcards flashcards sorry today i've done uh william harvey the black death and the great plague so for flashcards i've still got edward jenner john snow penicillin and lung cancer flashcards and then i might do some seneca and then drama portfolio create um anger monologue and photography analysis but i have actually done one two three four five six seven out of i don't even know how many there are things uh that i needed to do today so i'm actually like quite glad i've managed to do that i'm actually gonna have a bit of a break from uh flashcards and mind maps for now just because i've done those for like the whole of the video so far so now i might go on to you know i might go check my portfolio um start my monologue or do some photography or something like that but yes yeah, so i'll give you guys another bit of a time lapse but before i do i am actually gonna have a little quick break maybe until eight o'clock so nine minute break just because i've done so much work in history today and you know if i don't have a break i'll literally forget it all but yeah so um now on to a time lapse <laughs> to my drama portfolio to see if there was like anything that I could do to um, make it better or answer another question um, I think I did like a tiny bit but um, but I didn't really answer another question because we haven't really got that far into creating it yet so I didn't think I'd answer question three I might do that next week because it doesn't really have to be done for a while because we haven't really as I just said, got into it that much. And then um, I did a monologue. You might have been sitting on my screen like, why is she searching up why teenagers get angry? That is because I don't know why we get angry. Um, I was just searching them up because I've got create, uh, well I have created a little one minute sort of 30 second monologue for my scene because there's four of us. So we do a little opening. I do my scene, my monologue, another scene, their monologue another scene their monologue another scene their monologue and then we don't know what we're going to do after that because it's got to be something like 15 to 20 minutes long so i've completed my monologue i'm just going to show the guys on tuesday because that's when we're having an after school practice and then i have a lesson in drama on the wednesday and the thursday but um the only thing i haven't done today because i am going to finish uh, working now the only thing i haven't done today is edward jenner flashcards john snow flashcards penicillin flashcards lung cancer flashcards seneca history and photography analysis all the history stuff doesn't matter that i haven't finished it today because i haven't got the exam until after half term which obviously there's going to be a study with me up for then because I'm just constantly doing study with me at the minute just because I have lots and lots of work to do and I actually do like studying at home because it's basically like teaching yourself at home or like filling up some work at home just because I find it so much easier and I do like I learn a lot more at home and then my photography analysis doesn't really have to be done like like whenever that like, can be done like whenever I've got a lesson in photography tomorrow so I can do the analysis then as well as create um a contact sh contact sheet that i need to put in my book so yeah so this is the end of the video i hope you guys really did enjoy it if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already um also leave me a nice comment as i like to read all your comments um you know check out all my social medias and check out any other of my videos um which are study videos or you can go back really far and watch all my different types of videos but yeah uh, also if you have any video requests leave them in the description below in the description in the comments below or just dm me on any type of social media but yeah i hope to see you guys in my next video
Bye.